Hey y'all, it's Cam, better known as XCaramel24 on YouTube. Um, if you're new to my channel, um, I guess this would be a weird introduction, huh? I don't make videos because I'm bored. I don't make videos because I just want something to do. I make videos when I don't have peace, and I don't have peace. So I, I have dreams and visions. So I know that this dream and vision, I don't even want to tell you, but I have to. But I have to go ahead and share this because when I woke up, it really bothered me. So I said, okay, I'm going to go ahead and make a video. And I go on my home feed today, and I saw a few things that made me see how important it was to do the video. So, no, my videos aren't very professional. Um, no, I'm, try I'm not using the most high-def cameras and awesome editing it just is what it is I have visions I didn't ask for this gift I have it they always are accurate they always come true so I'm just sharing it with you maybe you all can give me some information that would be helpful to me because I don't quite understand this one um, in this vision there were tornadoes this is before the string of tornadoes hit here in the United States and the tornadoes were coming down sideways. And as I'm riding down the street, I'm saying to my um, sister in Christ, Do you see this tornado? Look, look at this. It's coming down sideways. Like it was so unnatural. Almost manufactured would be the best way to explain it. And so... It was just great destruction, just so much destruction. A lot of people were severely injured. There were dead bodies. It was just like a lot of people lost their lives. Um, a lot of people lost everything that meant something to them. And it was really sad because it was nothing nobody could do about it. And I kept getting the odd feeling it wasn't an act of God. Throughout the whole vision, I just kept, as I'm looking at it, can you imagine looking at this tornado coming down sideways? And I believe within the next two or three months, we'll probably get some video uploads on YouTube with tornadoes that look very unnatural. Or tornadoes happening in places where it's not natural. But it's going to be something very unnatural about it um, and a lot of people blame God for a lot of things that happen and it's really mankind and it's the evil that our minds conceive it's the evil you know I'm uh, if you can look at my playlist and tell I'm a bit of conspiracy theorist I don't believe in conspiracies I believe that things happen in secret that the main society doesn't know about and if you call that a conspiracy theory call it what it may um, but over the years, many things have been proven to be true. And stuff is still coming out. With that being said, about a week later, which, well, a little bit over a week, which was yesterday, day before yesterday, I hadn't been having any dreams and visions. You know, like stupid things, but not like this. And yesterday in the dream, um, and I, I explained the difference between dreams and visions and divine visitations in some of my other videos. If you never heard that, but there is a difference. Um, when you can feel, touch, see, smell, you're having a, a vision or a divine visitation. Um, you're getting information about the future or a future event or prophetic or something of that nature. That's a prophetic vision. So <laughs> visions do come in, in different forms and dreams and for different reasons and this particular one I can I cannot get it out of my head actually I had this yesterday um there should have been a moon in the sky but the moon had disintegrated or almost disappeared something happened to the moon and the only thing was left was a spiral and I'm standing outside saying, what just happened to the moon? 
people are going on about their daily life like they didn't notice. And, you know, I, I'm a sky watcher. I pay attention to the sky. It's just something about the sky that communicates to me um, signs. And the Bible tells us to pay attention to signs and wonders. So I watch the sky. So this is not um, something out of the ordinary to have an envision. And I felt like God was speaking to me. And everyone are getting their groceries or whatever they're doing, going about daily life. And I'm standing there saying, do you all notice this? Like the moon isn't giving its light anymore. And it was like a few people had dawned on them. And they're like, oh, yeah, it, it sure isn't, you know, just, I mean, like how most people are. And, um, and so within a few minutes of noticing that the moon was no longer giving its light, something had happened. I see one, two, three other spirals in the sky. And, and I remember counting because I remember the numbers being significant. It was a significance about it. And I'm counting and I'm like, one, two, three. Now there are three sets, three other spirals in the sky. And it was the oddest thing just to see. You're so used to seeing the sky being one way and all of a sudden see it change. I was just, I was dumbfounded. So before I uploaded this video, I did a little research. And from what I found out, it reminded me of Wormwood in the book of Revelation. And I'm going to do more reading on it. And I may do another video.